during the Oklahoma State Fair. Fox 25 Sarah Smith live tonight at the fair with what this petition means to the family. Sarah. Wendy, under these bright lights, two women disappeared. The family now has a glimmer of hope, but they worry that the killer is still out here. Sisters Cheryl Ginzer and Lisa Pennington's cold case likely getting a fresh look. No family should wait 36 years for justice. A judge signed off on a petition for the family to get 500 or more signatures in 45 days. If they do, a grand jury can take a look at the case. The family is elated. They're excited. They feel hope for the first time in a long time. A citizen or citizen feels that the regular law enforcement channels are not being used adequately to investigate you know, what they believe is a crime. In 1987, the pair goes missing after leaving the Oklahoma State Fair with some guys. Their bodies turn up a month later. Until now, it's a case gone cold, weighing heavy on the family's hearts. They want the evidence tested according to the latest DNA standards. They want people who've gone around confessing multiple times over these years to be investigated and questioned and let the chips fall after that. Cheryl and Lisa's loved ones still believe the killer is out there. We know there were multiple people involved in this and if there is a killer still out there, I think they're always dangerous. If somebody's killed, we, who, who would say, yeah, let's just, let's just let that guy go free. The family tells us that they plan to start asking for signatures for the petition right away. Live the State Fair, Sarah Smith, Fox 25 News. All right, Sarah, thank you. And we have got some storm chances moving into the state.